Hello there! I am going to be doing a brief demonstration of Shaman, which is a text user interface that I developed to manage connections to servers via Secure Shell. I'm a pretty avid self-hoster. I've got a bunch of virtual machines, and managing all of those was getting a little bit unwieldy, so I went ahead and made this. So right now we are looking at the text user interface. You can navigate by using the arrow keys. Everything is stored in files in the default directory for now, so that's .config slash shaman. You can version control this if you would like to, put it in git, uh, distribute it that way, so it's pretty easy to manage. You'll notice here that I've got pretty much anything that you'd want to um, have as far as storing information about the servers that you have access to. And then you can see here, so for example, I've got a, in my basement, I've got a pie hole. So that is the configuration I would use to connect. So now that I've selected it with enter, all I have to do is hit, is hit C and I'm SSH'd into my machine. Similarly, I can go back there and if I select it again by pressing enter and then S, then I am now SFTP'd into the machine. There's also a command line. Now you're noticing, you're probably noticing I have this alias to SMN. Uh, there are instructions for how to do that in the readme. So there's also a command line application. Initialize sample is what I use to, to um, populate the configuration that you were looking at a moment ago. It has a, a group one and group two and a couple of examples to get you started. <coughs> if you'd like to add a group, all you have to do is make a group. And in this case, I've added home and basement. Well, it already exists, so it doesn't do anything. Similarly, I can add a server. In this case, I already have the command up and running, so all I've got to do is hit enter, and there you go. <clears throat> it, it actually recreated my um, JSON file, but if it didn't already exist, it would have just created it there. So that's the application in a nutshell. Hopefully uh, people find it useful, and um, yeah, looking forward to hearing from people.